everybody. Apologies for the darkness, but uh, it's how we're working tonight. This is just a very quick review of uh, Sinker on Xbox One, which is uh, being released on the 17th of April 2020. It's been developed and published by a one-man team uh, at uh, Wala Digital. The price is £4.19, £4.99, €4.99, but I believe it's on sale um, if you pre-order it. I think you get like 20% off or something like that. Okay, so, Sinker is a game where you control hooks, teleporters, and various other things to move uh, pucks, or, or they're called pucks in the game, not hockey pucks, and you have to move them into holes like that. Um, it's very, very simple. Um, some of the later puzzles do get difficult, but uh, it's it's a pretty short game. I mean, if you use a guide, you're looking at maybe an hour. If you're using your brain, two to three hours. I mean, I got through like 80, 85% of the game in the space of an hour using my brain. So, you know, <laughs> there we go. But, um... Yeah, it's a very simple game. I do like I do like the music. The graphics I like. Um, as I said the music, the ambientic music is super goddamn chill. I love it. Um, as you go through the game, um, as you can see, the game teaches you how things work. Um, and you're on a grid, so you can see where everything's going. Later on, you'll be able to flip the hook side to side. Um, so you can move things around, um, and yeah, it's it's basically it's uh, it is basically a puzzle game. It's short, it's cheap, and it's, it's an easy. It is a very easy thousand gamer score. Uh, it's very enjoyable. Um, I have done a promo stream of this, but that will not be recorded due to uh, a couple of issues that we've had. But those issues have now been rectified by the developer, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, as I said, the game is... It's a really good puzzle game. Um, if you like this kind of thing, it'll make you think. And that's always, always a good thing, isn't it? Um, but you can see as I'm playing, some of them are getting a little more complicated now. So like you have to move move them from hook to hook, for example. And later on you'll have square pucks as well. And square pucks can't go in circle pucks. They can go in square holes, but the circle pucks can go in square holes. So um, it is a case of uh, watching what you're doing, using your brain, and uh, don't do anything stupid effectively. So, so I'm not going to, this video isn't going to be that long because I'm specifically not wanting to show all of the answers. See, now, now, now we're able to flip. Um, this is now, I should note that there was a glitch for me on level 52 um, where I was taking my time. Now, the developer has already isolated that issue. Um, and it will be patched before the game is fully released. So you don't have to work out, worry about that, but I am giving full disclosure. He's also mentioned that he may... Uh, he's also mentioned that he may... Uh, he may change the control system. So, of course, look here you can see we can actually flip and... Pull, pull hook around and pull it with another hook but he said he may flip the control system around so that for example the the restart which is right trigger uh, that will be that could be for example put on the Y button and the undo could be put on the B button um, he's he's looking into this um, yeah so yes Wrong button. So here you can see we are uh, 
using hooks to pull the pucks off of the uh, single hook. So yeah, I'm not going to play any more of it because I don't want to spoil it for anybody. But um, there are guides out there on YouTube. I fully enjoyed this game when I was playing through it. Um, and I'm going to give the game a 9 point. Seven. It's very unique, and if you don't want, if you don't follow a guide, you will feel really clever when you work out some of the later puzzles. So yeah, I'm officially giving Sinker for the Xbox One a 9.7 out of 10. Um, as I've said, normally this would be a uh, th this would be a longer uh, promo stream video, but. Uh, due to issues, um, I can't upload that video. So this is just going to be the quick review video. Um, and yeah, flop, you're getting an easy game of score for four quid, five dollars, and it's a good uh, it's a good time waster for a couple of hours, um, and it really makes you think. I said, and as you go through, it will teach you more and more mechanics, and it teaches you, teaches you them very very well as you go through the certain groups of levels it will teach you how to use them what to do um yeah i i i said the only thing that i can fault this game for is the controls at the moment aren't aren't intuitive but the developer says yes he's, he's probably going to change them to what i've suggested so yeah 9.7 out of 10 for sinker on xbox one you can pre-order it now for less than the prices um that are listed above the main game part of the window and uh, if you're watching this after release date it will be the prizes that are listed so yeah thank you everybody for watching this quick video and um, thank you to Wilder Digital for providing me the code to do this promo and review uh, thank you very much and uh, look after yourselves have a good one